RD Custom Diecast. I'm going to do a little mail call today. I uh, got some stuff in. I believe it's all from whatnot. Uh, we'll take a look. We'll open it up. Stop by Walgreens. I had to go get a battery for a uh, optic that I put on a pistol. And uh, while I was there, just checked their Hot Wheels. Picked up a few things. And these are copyright 2017. So everything they had on their pegs was 2018 stuff. So pretty cool. Here's a little uh, Porsche police car. I thought that's pretty cool. Might use that for a project. And the Corvette CZ Z O C7 Z O Z O six convertible. That was on the pegs. Pretty cool. And uh, I only picked up three. Uh, they had more, but I just left. There wasn't really anything else I was interested in. Six eight Chevy Nova Gulf Gulf livery. Probably just do. We'll swap on that puppy right there. So got those. Uh, and then we got the mail call. So let's get right in the mail call. We'll take a look, see what we got. 814 Card World. Now I've got stuff from him before. I don't know if this is something I bought. I've won some stuff for free. So I don't know if uh, this might have been a freebie. I don't know if I've won a freebie from him. I think I have. Uh, I've kind of lost track. I have to go back in my WhatNot account and uh, take a look and see what it says, what I've paid for, what I haven't. Uh, let's see here. Get rid of some of the junk here. All right. Guys, and I really don't know what's in, in these, so uh, even though I bid on them, the time... I've been on so much stuff over the holidays. Got really good deals on on just about everything that uh, I kind of lost track. So let's see here. No, I don't think. Uh, yeah, these are ones I, I apparently bid on. So yeah, I remember these. So here is a. Uh, 2010 Camaro SS police car and this is from 2011 so 2012 pretty cool let me skip up a little bit guys where I can get a little bit closer to there this ain't one for card world I believe he's in I was gonna say New York but why not just look on the box and I'll tell you Pennsylvania Johnstown, Pennsylvania. Uh, I believe he's actually got a full-blown die-cast and hobby shop, so uh, that's pretty cool. Got a Corvette Coupe, and this one is from 96. And I thought it's going to look a little cooler than it does, but it looks okay. This might wind up getting a paint job. It's all right. It's got like a metallic green. And I may dabble a little bit and uh, spray a little 2K clear on it and just see if I'll make it pop a little bit better. And that may be all as it takes. Uh, but kind of looks almost a satin finish. So I don't think it was like that. I think this may be age. This is 2013. It's going to be the shoebox. I thought this was a pretty cool looking car. So I got it. I do not have that one in my collection. So. Hey, what the heck? Then I got the uh, Corvette Stingray. I like the, the flames on this one look better on the uh, on the screen than they do on per in person. But they're all right. That's not bad. I could give this to somebody probably. Or I could customize it. It's got a metal base. That's kind of cool. And this one's from 98. So 
And the last one from him I got was the 68 Mercury Cougar. Love this car, Edelbrock. And this is 2011. Check that out. I'm definitely hanging on to that one. I'll probably have popped this out on Takeout Tuesday. And I might just do a wheel swap on this one. We'll see. The wheels actually look pretty cool on it. So, I don't know. I might not. Cards are right on it. Uh, we'll have to see. But it may see a may me to take out Tuesday. All right, this one says Daniel Ortiz, Los Angeles, California. Give me just a second. Let me uh, scoot this stuff out of the way real quick. All right. Again, no idea. No idea. I think else is going to strangle me if I get on whatnot anymore. Unless it's to help her. She did uh, her she did, uh, arts and crafts uh, live. Uh, didn't do too hot the first time. She did her die cast live stream. She did pretty good. Proud of her. She did a great job. And I'll be putting out what she does some more. Uh, let's see. Gun locators number 20. Let's see what it says here. One item. Paid eight bucks for it. So let's see what I paid eight dollars for. A big box. this one all right let me get the packaging material over there Tim the tool man Taylor home improvement uh, poor guy he didn't make the trip very well he is laying on his back right now but I ordered it uh, I like the little Benford tool toolbox you get to see it 334 convertibles pretty cool and the dixie choppers pretty darn cool as well here you go guys so i wanted the uh that tool time tim's supposed to be posed up here on the uh dixie chopper but he's not posed up there so uh i may open this up seeing that uh he's flat on his back and didn't make it too well. I might could toss him up there like that. Before I mess something up, we'll just stop. So pretty cool. I like that. I like it. I like it a lot. Let me grab this last box and we'll open it up. Dennis Larson. I'm not sure what seller uh, name he goes under. Uh, pretty sure this because the name doesn't look familiar, so I'm pretty sure it's whatnot. Looks like it's got an invoice in it. Again, yeah, something I paid eight bucks for, and there's only one item in here. Let me just double check. It's all just packing material. Well, I guess I bid only once but either I won something with that or uh, maybe I got a giveaway so let's see here Gibby number five yep I got an arrow sculpt I've got one of these I'll give it to Elsie and she can put it in her stuff and pass it on to somebody else so that's pretty cool uh, but I do have this I'm not too big on the wheels, the four spokes. I know a lot of people like them. I really don't care for them personally, so I won't rob the wheels off of it. I don't need them. Uh, I got some four spokes. I think I got these exact ones probably. 
but that's pretty cool that was a giveaway so I'll show you some stuff you can give away it's some, that's premium and i got a green light california low rider so i don't remember what it looked like so i'm going to show you guys first and then i'm going to take a look at it take that sticker off is it cool let me know i don't know yet because i've bought a couple low riders lately Oh yeah, 72 Cadillac Coupe de Ville. That's pretty sweet looking. All right, now that I've seen it, can show you something about it. Decals on it. And it looks pretty sharp, I like it. I like it, I like it a lot. Very cool, very cool. Uh, I've got some more whatnot stuff coming in. It's slowly trickling in over the holidays. Uh, wound up getting some more stuff, so we got plenty of videos coming up about mail calls, and we'll do some takeout Tuesdays. Got some builds coming up, but I'm in the middle. If y'all know, I've got two channels going on. I'm in the middle of working on some stuff for the other channel. It's really tied me up. Uh, I've got some builds uh, that I promised out. I've got to get out, so I'm, I'm gonna get started back. And what's funny about it, I've got a lot of them stripped. I just got to go through the process of finish prep it, prepping the bodies, painting them, doing whatever I'm going to do to the interior and all that stuff. So uh, they are started. They got started, some of them got started a month ago and still haven't got touched. Uh, see, we got a Ferrari that we are still working on. Got to shoot the uh, base coat on it, get the decals on it shoot clear that'll be good to go um we'll have some how to's on that just I'm not gonna make the videos long I'm, I'm trying to cut my videos down to probably about 15 20 minutes these 30 45 minute ones just i, I just think they're counterproductive you guys got better things to do than watch the whole thing and uh most of you guys know exactly what to do any, anyway. It's it's not that big a deal. Some of you don't, and those of you don't, please watch it. You'll get something out of it. All right, guys. If you're subscribed, thank you so much for being subscribed. Do appreciate it. If you're not subscribed, it makes me sad. Uh, maybe you should consider subscribing. I'd greatly, greatly appreciate it. That'd make me happy if you did. Uh, if you don't, I understand. But I sure love it if you did. Uh, sure helps the algorithm, helps uh, drive other traffic here. Certainly appreciate it. And uh, hopefully it's helping those of you in the community, some of the stuff y'all see, uh, or give y'all some ideas. Um, hit that bell notification icon, that way you know when we're putting out new videos. And that's it guys, I'll catch you in the next episode.